welcome to Common 7 at Concord High School, more traditionally known as the Science Department. My name is Tim Sloan, the Head of Science and speaking on behalf of the amazing staff we have in our faculty. One of the key attractions we have at Concord High School in the Science Department is the animal room. We've got a range of animals including Queen Lizzie the Bearded Dragon, Right next door to Queen Lizzie, we have Skylar the Stimson's Python. And when you get the opportunity to meet this particular green tree frog, you will know why we have named him Grumpy the Green Tree Frog. And here we have Spotty, named for obvious reasons. Spotty is a Gillens tree frog, a native of the Northern Territory. And here we have another guest appearance by the amazing Mr. David Galea, also known as Fishman, due to his love and passion for all things marine science. We will now take you around one of our six dedicated science lab spaces. These lab spaces have a mix of traditional tables and seats surrounded by workstations where students get to conduct a range of fun science experiments, always in a safe way of course. In your time at high school, in year 7 to 10, you will get to study a whole range of general science subjects including a little bit of physics, chemistry, biology and earth and space. At the end of year 10, you will be loving science so much that you will have the option to choose one, two or even three sciences in your senior years. What happens when you mix magnesium with heat energy? You get magnesium oxide, which can then be used to ignite a methane bubble, demonstrating a combustion reaction. Have you ever wondered what happens when you mix sodium with water? Well, let's find out. Mr. Galea was the only one crazy enough to find out on our behalf. die from coconuts each year than sharks. Coconuts are simply too dangerous to be allowed to continue in this universe. While they might be slightly dangerous, their benefits outweigh their downgrades, as you can use coconut tree wood or palm tree wood to make beautiful houses for your family. Also, there are benefits from coconuts, but what's better than to just eat the whole watermelon? You could make dishes from watermelon peels and eat the watermelon flesh.